Yeah. Welcome to the art stream for Guardians of the Galaxy. And I think this is the first time I'm going to be properly listening to the original uh, metal album they recorded for the game. Hopefully it doesn't get me a copyright claim, because it's the only music that do that shouldn't get a copyright claim from that game. It's the only one that was marked as stream safe when they during the or inside the game. Uh, so I already ahead of time got the reference. I of course have to put myself into the Bad Lord outfit. So... Hmm. I'm trying. Uh, which version of me do I want to use as my starting base? Let's rip off the legs of this version of me. We're just gonna work over here and then determine what side we want on. I almost want to take the upper half of this one, but I don't think it'll proportions will be right because it's all bulky from the armor it wears. So I think we're gonna pull the upper half from this version of me. Again, the more of these I do, the easier and faster I'm gonna be able to get at it because I'm just gonna be able to rip off more chunks from different versions of me. Because by stealing this version of me, I just copied or I didn't, yeah, I didn't delete. The Fallout one basically gets most of the work for my jeans already done for me. But I know I want to sever the arms. Boom. Guardians of the Galaxy game was so fucking fun. I'm low-key sad that I'm done with it. Alright, well now we're gonna steal the legs off, I mean the arms off this one. A little bit of kit bashing to save time, you know? Oh no, having trouble with your phone? Let me know if the music is too loud and needs to be turned down, by the way. The arm looks good on this version of me because the way the power armor is, but it looks weird on here. Hold on, let's... Yeah. I wish we'd gotten to hear more of this soundtrack in the game. Like, I, I mentioned this complaint several times when I was playing it. But they 100% should have made it so that fucking the the all the music was just replaced with this music instead of just having large chunks of silence and playing no music like they did. Such a problem with the original game. All right, that's a good starting silhouette. It's going to need a lot of cleaning up, obviously, because the body shape isn't quite there yet. But we'll get a lot of it done as we give him things like his jeans jacket. Uh, we're going to start by just... Ooh. Fill all that in white. Let's draw out a space for the jeans using a green. That'll help me. The jean shirt or jean jacket. So the jean jacket would go down to about here. Mm. 
Yeah, he tore the sleeves off. So it would be like... Yeah. In my brain, this is always like... This is one of the series on the channel. So a lot of YouTube I watch, I usually like stuff that I throw on in the background while I'm doing chores and such. And I like to think my art streams is kind of like that for a lot of people. Like I try and aim for a mix of like content that people will sit down and pay attention to and content that people will just have on in the background, you know? Go. Yeah, my art streams currently are sort of once in a blue moon, but on the Discord I am holding a vote uh, that is basically like, hey, do y'all want to see more of the art streams? Because if I did more, I might, uh, hang on, if I go to my old saved layer, I might try and make Pokemon sprite artwork again like I did back in the day. Um. Uh. Do Might get a tablet and draw. Just draw whatever the fuck, you know? Any random idea that comes into your brain. Like, draw a character you like in a show. Draw a character you make up in your head. Uh, there's, you can find, there's things online that generate drawing concepts for people. If you want to start drawing, the best thing to do is just pick up a pen and start making whatever. A lot of elements. These arms look really weird. I'm actually thinking I might just. I'm honestly just gonna delete these arms. I've changed my mind about using them. And we're gonna go re-steal the upper arm from this version of me. Oop. I remember, uh, been drawing for seven years, but I run out of ideas very fast. Yeah. What I did back in the day that got, like, to get me to draw more, it was, it was to get me to draw more and get more to give me a creative outlet, was I did my Pokemon Fusion stuff, where I just, every single day, I was like, I need to pick two random Pokemon and fuse them with a gener- well, actually, at first I was picking, uh, Pokemon that shared breeding types, and my idea was to make a mix of every breed, po like pair of Pokemon that could breed. Which is why I got made a bunch of Lickitung ones at first. But then I started getting requests, and I was like, "Oh, I'll do that." Like back in my Tumblr days when I did my art on Tumblr. Well, we are gonna steal a hand off of another me, though. Okay, we're gonna steal this hand. Or hang on, let's uh... Let's see, if I wanted to make a proper scale... Let's quickly try and draw Star-Lord's gun. So it would be... And let me get a better image of it. This is a much better reference image of what I'm going to be making. So, 
so. Now oh, you can see sort of the normal pistol handler right there. Rotate. Yeah, there we go. Alright. So. Hang on. Um. There we go. Sort of. enough space for a full hand so let's go ahead and just steal this hand for scaling hold on oh it's just So the top is clearly long, a little bit longer than the bottom. So we're going to do that. All right. In terms of length, it's about the length of a forearm. So let's go ahead and steal a forearm for reference. Uh, this is a good forearm to steal for reference. Here so we can keep the gun in view while we draw. Most of the handle part's gonna be covered in the end, so I don't need to make it look great. like that try ever tried animation oh uh, no but this program that I use uh, Asprite does have a built-in animation mode like it's actually designed for sprite animations so if I did that I could create a new frame and then like I actually don't know how it would work yeah like yeah new frame and if on frame two, I just did that. Yeah. So I probably could animate if I took time. Here, like this. Hmm. 
This is actually make parts of this a little longer. It's not bulky enough yet. Make this a little longer that way. There we go. Um, we're gonna use the Oliver Cart pink. Boom. And it's got a little pink spot here. A pink bit through there. This actually isn't a hot enough pink. I want a hotter pink. That looks much better. And then a little stripe of pink there. That's okay for now. I'll probably touch it up more later. Alright, back to working on this part. So he's got all of those buttons there. We're only gonna give him one button though, and it's of course gotta be. Uh, ba bum. Come on. Uh, sprite layer. I was gonna give him a little patch that is the Oli Rakar on his chest. Right where the buttons go. Alright, um. It's got a little skull belt buckle. We're gonna grab this hand here. Right? Mm, maybe not. I don't really think I have a hand that has the position I would want existing already, actually. Edit, flip horizontal. And here's what we're gonna do, we're gonna cheat a little bit. Uh, do you say if you like Ghost Band? Sorry if uh, I'm focused on something I don't play, pay much attention to what happens around. Ghost Band? I've, ne I've never heard of Ghost Band. Oh, why do I have mass select on? This one's a little, this arm's a little shrunk because it's for a kid's scale. Like most genres, so I'll probably give him a listen at some point if I remember to. Hmm. Hold on, I stole that hand from somewhere else, didn't I? Which means that I ripped that hand off of this hand. I'm gonna steal this. These two hands. We're gonna steal real fast. Oh, I was on the right layer to steal, damn it. Whip. Ba -ba -bum -bum -bum.
Come on, it looks perfect. Why is it? It's exactly what I want until I release. And I think I see what I gotta do. Let's try it like this. I don't understand. What time is it for me? It's 11 p.m. right now. There we go, that's that. Bro, you saw that, it just, it was exactly the hand I wanted. All right, we gotta fucking do it manually, I guess. God. Hang on, I gotta like, memorize what, what it looks like before it fucks up. Okay, here's what we gotta do. There we go. Oh, both east uh, Eastern Time Zone. Nice. Then if you're a night owl like me, you'll probably be able to catch a lot of my streams. Same, I'm, I'm, like I said, massive night owl. Yes, I know this. the arm looks horribly wonk. Don't worry, it's not anywhere near finalized. to help. Alright. So that's sort of the guiding line of our arm. Here we go. quiet for a second. Might have been a connectivity issue. Oh, uh, it's raining in your area. I love the rain. It's so relaxing. Though it is shitty that the internet fucks up when it rains. God! Those arms! They look terrible! Oh my god! 
Okay, we're just gonna tuck this monstrosity aside for a moment. It's just... Hang on. Let's try and get like... Hang on, think. This space to the... Sorry, I'm just thinking about bodily proportioning a little bit. Yeah, I love the rain. What I just do? Gonna be freezing as hell in the morning. Yeah. There we go. Use that as the frame for. Let's see how long, how thick are my arms most of the time? Yeah, this feels like a good brush size. All right, there we go. That's a little bit of a better map out for arms. That will look a lot more human. Oh. An alarm was going off on my phone that I forgot to turn off. I kind of covered up part of the gun there. That's looking a lot nicer, his arms. Com especially com left compared to right. Oh, way better. Oh, I remember this song playing in the game. Oh, what the fuck? Hit the wrong key.
arm looks a little weird still. I think it's... over here. arm looks so off. I'm doing something really wrong with it. Man, give me your arm for a second. Oh shit. There it is. The curve is going way too far out. That looks a bit- a good bit better, actually. And actually... His sleeves run down to just past the elbow. There we go, now the arms are looking okay. Although, hang on, let me just... The gun is backwards. To how I would want it. Hold on. Wait. Yeah. I have the gun upside down on both hands. Get down here for a moment to a less cluttered area. Shut up. 
see, like again, I'm mentioning, I mentioned, keep mentioning the fact that they should have put this music into the game more and made it more present. This would have been fantastic to have playing during the final fucking fight in the game. But no, or during like the big final battle confrontations that were happening. But they didn't, because they kept trying to pop in the music that was turned off because I had streamer mode on. Also, oh my god, the hand. The hand. No, no, the hand looks right, never mind. Although, that being said, you'd see that parts of the handle creeping through. Hang on. It's a little weird looking, but I think the hand looks okay. For now, at least. Alright, it's starting to come together. Alright, so now if we... There we go, it's coming together a good bit now. The torso is not as thick as it needs to be. That's one thing I'm noticing. I see what's going on. The legs are backwards compared to where the tor rest of the torso is. The curve of the legs doesn't match up with the curve of the body. That's what's looking really weird right now. So we're just gonna do this. Go back to the sprite layer. It's like something looks really weird with the legs and the the torso, and then it finally clicked what was going what was weird.
And I actually think I'm gonna... Yeah, putting the gun in front looks way nicer. Alright, I think we're getting this very good. I'm, I'm gonna... Actually, no, I should have the headphones, because that's a very important part of Star-Lord. We're gonna pull a little bit of this guy's orange to help give this thing some color. And a little bit of uh, uh, that gold. And there's a cassette player on our hip. Alright, I think this is coming together really fucking good now. Um, we need a good, like, meaty belt buckle still. We're just gonna pull this color for it. We're gonna fix the feet up it a bit. And I think I'm gonna do something fun with the shirt. Um, actually, do I want to do something fun with it? It's a little bit hard to. Hang on. So I'm gonna do something really funny. I think. Um, let me. Hold on. There it is. Oh, I see the logo layer is locked. Hold on. We're gonna do a massively shrunk version of my logo. Under his jacket. See, you can't really tell that's what it is, but like in the spirit. In spirit, we know. Alright. Now, we know that he doesn't wear fucking boots, he wears sneakers. Um, who's the version of me that has some nice sneakers on? We're gonna take the shoes off this version. There we go. Now I know this doesn't quite make sense yet, but don't worry, we're gonna fix...
Hold on. Oh, we hit the end of the, the Star-Lord album. Let's just, boop, loop it back. Because it's uh, the, the, you know, the music for the game that we're doing art for. Oh, this is looking pretty gosh dang good so far. I think we're actually gonna delete this foot and just This is looking okay. Now we gotta play with lighting a little bit. Also, we gotta figure out what side they're going. Alright, hang on. Let's just. The way I have positioned, light comes in from this direction, so. Okay. I think the lighting looks okay. Alright, so let's go ahead and pluck. I think we're done with it, so let's pluck him. Hide the whip, hide the reference layer. So which side has less of me? On the right we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. On the left we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Hmm. It almost doesn't feel right. Hold on. This is the center point, right? So if I go like this... We got a, a length of 50, right? No, I'm looking at the wrong thing. There, 530. And if we go in the other direction, we get a measurement of 536. Okay, so it's gonna go on this side. What the fuck? Oh, cause I'm on the... Ooh. I was like, why isn't it pasting the thing? And there's my Star-Lord form.
There we go, had to flip them horizontal. I was like, the lighting doesn't look right. And actually, the lighting still doesn't quite look right. There we go. Making it look- oh, oh wait. Would the gun be cast- I don't think the gun would be casting a shadow on this leg in that way. Alright, I think that looks a little better. Hold on. Oh! I know what I'm doing that could not- or I'm not doing that could make this look a lot better. Little, little changes that help with the appearance a lot. Alright, I, I, I've got to stop. Oh, hang on, hang on. <laughs> I was about to say, i got to stop fidgeting. And then looked at it a little bit and was like, wait, no, something's not right. There we go, that looks a little better. Alright, so we've got Star-Lord version of me right alongside all of the others now. Which, um... Hang on, now if I do this... Ooh! what I do wrong? Banner disappeared. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Instead of updating, it just disappeared. So there we go. Uh, expect updates to the YouTube and Tumblr and all the other versions at some point in the future. Yeah. And um, if you haven't been watching, paying attention on the YouTube channel, we of course have the. Uh, the Cult of the Lamb series has been upgraded to take the place of Guardians of the Galaxy, so be sure to be checking that out. And also starting next week, with us having just finished Portal 2, uh, go and check out Creeper World 4, which has received the upgrade, and this is going to be getting higher upload rates. Uh, if you loved the Guardians of the Galaxy series and want something similar, I highly recommend you check out the Batman Arkham Origins series. It's a similar superhero thing, and 
If you want more art stuff, there should be on YouTube a link coming up right around now to a playlist. I'll see all of you in the next video, and be sure to catch out an episode of Creeper World 4 that goes up today. Bye bye.